welcome back. As you can see, we're back in holiday mode, if you could call it that. And we're just, David's just strapping children in the car, and we're just going to head down to the local car boot sale. It's a beautiful sunny day. They have beautiful weather down here. It's obviously been very dry. The grass isn't very green. It's quite, quite brown, actually, which is sort of unusual. Um, so we're just hopping in the van in the people mover with all our people and we're going to head down to the car boot sale and just see what's there. This is our third time down here in probably about a week. We've come down for like a couple of days at a time, zip time for a day or two. Are you and locked come... in or locked out Charlie? Come I think David wants us to get a move Quiet on. David say hi to the people. Hi everybody. I hope I kind of get myself in shot because I can't see myself because look what happened to my selfie mode. Just just wait, look. Do, do, do you see that? Do you see that circle around me? Um, because the phone has been dropped numerous times by a certain little boy who plays the games on my phone and it's kind of loosened up and if I put my finger where the camera is and push it in then it's all better but it doesn't stay there it kind of gradually pops out and I get this romantic vignette look about me so um, bear with, bear with right we've got to get going so catch you soon okay so look i'm rocking the sunglasses over the spectacles by the way very rude isn't it to talk to you while i'm wearing sunglasses um oh well, we've come to the car park where the car boot sale is meant to be as per the sign at the end of the road and there's nothing apparently we're too late it's like the story of the three little pigs when the third little pig and the wolf kept arranging to meet and the third little pig would go early and the wolf would miss it so we're like wolves um, but hey, have a look at what's here. Um, yeah, and this is kind of like a, a playground for rich Aucklanders, I think, who can afford to own their own little planes. You see that? And have houses, and instead of cars, they park their airplane outside. And there's a house, oh, and a helicopter. Okay, and there's a, a house for sale there. It's probably a holiday batch actually because they live in Auckland and they come down here for the weekend nice for some and so people just fly in and have a look at the house so there's an open home should we go just so we can go uh, do we look like executives it's Harcourt's executive real estate nice for some okay so clearly our plans have been scuppered so we're just going to head to the local shop, going over a Jada Bar. Whoa! Um, speed hump. So we're just going to go to the shop. I'll take the kiddies to the playground while David pops into the shop and buys underarm deodorant and peanut butter. So they put them on together. Sweet and sour. Taking my kitty to the playground to play on the playground. You don't untie the dog. Oh, that, that's the bag for picking up the doggy's poops. Down. You're a very placid little boy or girl. Dog. You're very nice. You look like you're in jail. Banging on the bars with a stick. Oh, Charlie, I bought that headband for little Miss Groovy so that I could hear her when she tiptoed off, but she takes it off. But at least I can find Charlie. Completely lost interest in the playground. 
awkward. Oh, hello, Shadow. Nice Shadow. I see. You trying to bust those out, buddy? I've just spotted some girls over there and they're filming which is really cool you know each other in portrait why don't people learn people don't film in portrait it's it's tacky awkward oh that's a minute. 